What's going on guys? I'm going to show you how to add a vector design to a flag in Carveco Maker. So basically the first thing you want to do is have a flag designed. I already have mine designed. I have all my stars grouped together and my stripes grouped together already. So you come up here to vector. You want to import your vector. Uh, I'll do a complicated one. And it works on easy and complicated ones the same way. So here I added an eagle. I'll just drag it over here. Shrink it a little bit. Find a good size. Maybe a little bit smaller. That looks pretty good. So what I'm going to do is right click on here. Group my vectors. Then I'm going to drag it over here into the flag. All right, here looks good. And what you're going to want to do is add an offset. We'll do like a 0.25 offset. Create that. And sometimes you might get some offset added inside bird or whatever else you're adding you'll just want to delete those but this one added it just around the outside and you want to make sure you want to do that outward to the right so that's done see so x out of here and basically you can see that it's going to cross one two three four five six so all six of my stripes so what i'm going to want to do is click on this i'm going to hit Control c to copy it Control V five more times so that will give us six offsets around the outside of the bird and I like to ungroup my stripes for this because sometimes you get problems when you're trying to do this so what you want to do is click on a stripe hold shift click on the offset I like to right click. You can either do it here, merge vectors and subtract, or you can come up here and do vectors, merge, subtract. And then you just want to go ahead and do that for every single one of these. Click, shift, click, merge, subtract, click, shift merge subtract just keep repeating that for every single one of these there you can see that it erases all the lines around like this would probably be pointless to have so I'm just going to go ahead and delete that and that's basically how you're going to go ahead and do that add a vector to a flag and get your stripes all set up thanks for watching